Welcome back to Meta War, friends and fans. It is time for some Chinese Civil War. We're about to have some uh, very cringe voice acting, but uh, let's listen up here at what's going on. All right, so everyone's going to have to stay sharp and come back alive. If you want to play this mod, make sure you click in the description to look for it. Planes are attacking here. So this is part of the Chinese Civil War where the PLA attacked the uh, was attacking the island of the NLA. And, uh, or, I, actually, I'm, I'm not even sure what the abbreviations are. But anyway, there's guys on this island. We gotta kill them. You know how the, you know how it goes. So, we're gonna be in charge of a couple of squads. We're gonna clear some positions and claim this for China. Apparently, this was the, uh, last stronghold for the ROC, the uh, Republic of China forces. So, the People's Liberation Army is gonna get up here and kick some ass. So, we've got a couple of positions to take here. Saving in progress. All done. Some enemies may hide themselves behind bushes, grass, or rocks. Search carefully and eliminate things. Right. So the mini maps off a little bit. You can tell like our, our forces somehow landed here. As long as they can. Show your courage, comrades. Aircrafts and warships are no longer something we can only dream about. All right. So we've got access to IL-10 support and frigate uh, Shenyan probably going to fire some shells as well. So on the right side, as you can see, there's a, a very large defensive line actually by this uh, large mountain or this uh, rocky terrain and then also it looks like there's some forces somewhere around here looks like they're here at the rocks and then a couple of uh, other forces here so we're gonna push up on the right side try to flank into the center and then support on the left side I think one thing that we can do is uh, probably just uh, let, let's see what it would be like if we were to fire the uh, shoot oh, oh I see the frigate Xingyang will use its cannons to attack uh, the target location because of its accuracy it's wise to take cover before it fires <laughs> And then the IL-10 support, of course, some sort of bomber. So let's see what happens. <clears throat> I think it'll be easier to take these positions that are out in the open. So let's see what happens when we fire here. And hopefully our men are far enough back. Firing and target location. So obviously this done by an uh, amateur voice actor and such. So it has like an authentic, uh, if, if he happens to be Chinese, it's interestingly uh, a Chinese accent that, uh, oh shit, there's some big shell hits coming in now. There we go. Let's see what happens. Very cool mod, by the way. Just a single mission and just a single um, download, so you really don't have to do much. Was that it? The glorious uh, Shen Yen fired one shell. Oh, okay, two shells. So again, with its inaccuracy, I'm trying to attack both positions here and here up on top of the hill. So we're going to see if it can do anything, and it looks like it really can't. So uh, that'll have to be uh, improved a little bit, I think, uh, if the mod maker is watching, which I hope they do. And again, uh, tell them Raptor sent you and give them some support too. All right, we do have medics with our squad, so we can do a little bit of a suicide rush. We've got to push up there quick and start slinging some grenades. That'll be the best thing to do. So let's go ahead and move up here as soon as we can and start clearing out some of the... Uh, Enemy forces. All right, let's throw some grenades. There we go. We're starting to eliminate them. There we go. Our forces are starting to make progress. There we go. Let's get up here and claim some of this territory. Oh, he's going to throw a grenade. Oh, shit. Run, boys. Right out in the uh, fire of a uh, MG, it was either that or the grenade. So we'll get medics up here in just a second, but let's continue to put the pressure on these guys. There we go. Too many of us for them to kill all at once. Looks like there's a mounted MG up there, so we can capture that if we need to. There we go. Looks like that's shut down. Okay, medics on station. We can recover all these guys. They're just wounded. Very good. Oh, shit. Left side not doing so well, though. All right, hold on. Let's take this MG up here. And let's get this medic rocking. Wow, hopefully our machine gun's that accurate and efficient. All right, we just captured the enemy MG up on the hill. Man, these guys screaming just sounds so horrific. They really sound like they're hurt. Oh no, our medic's down. All right, we'll have to go and rescue him. We'll get out there and get him. Top priority for the MG should be the other enemy MG over there. All right, we should have another uh, medic, but that's all right. We'll turn this officer into a medic then. Grab the medic bag from him and heal him up. 
There we go. And switch it back to him. No problem. There we go. All right, most of our men are still alive. Uh, we've got some stragglers back here, some some capitalist pig cowards who have stayed in the back. So we'll push up a little bit with them. Should have some extra guys here. Good, all right, now we can push over to the other side. So we've got a bit of a foothold here at this trench. And we'll close in on that with our infantry. We'll get a little closer, start crawling over that direction. Let's get another guy on this MG, that way we can move it. Two guys to uh, move this MG position. So as you can see here, there's a, there's a Maxim machine gun here. So in the era of 1955, the Chinese are still using the Maxim machine gun. All right, the Shen Yen can fire again, but let's see what the IL-10 can do. Let's go ahead and drop it right about here. This seems like a good position. Now let's see if that aircraft comes in. Meanwhile, while we're waiting for that, we will uh, send up some of our infantry to crawl to the bottom of that trench and start slinging grenades. Here comes the IL-10 now. Okay, I can we even see it? can't even see it. And he dropped his bombs all the way over there. So highly inaccurate, not easy to deal with. Alright, so the Xinyan is firing again. We'll continue to get support from our comrades offshore, which is accurate. I believe in this garrison, the ROC forces only had about a thousand men. As where the Chinese had about, uh, I think, three times that, plus warships, plus planes, plus possible armor support as well. So, yeah, as you can see, those specials, uh, they're super epically cool, except they can't hit anything. And when soldiers are in trenches, you need a direct hit. All right, good. We got some of our forces up here kicking ass. Starting to climb into those trenches. Oh, look at what we've got here. An enemy light howitzer that we can capture. That'll be nice. All right, most of our infantry is hanging back. Damn. These guys get wrecked. Come on, boys. Let's lead ourselves to victory. Wow, all right. We're doing really well. Let's get into that trench. I'm going to lead some of these guys into the trench and then also a couple of guys north of the trench or to the, uh, yeah, just north of the trench according to our compass. Wow, a couple of grenade tosses are really freaking them out. All right, let's get up there. Go, boys, go. There we go. All right, let's call in an IL-10 support strike on what position's over here that's hindering the allies from moving up. Our comrades. Oh, it looks like right about here. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, grenade. Good thing everyone was in cover. All right, guys, moving up to the next position right now. There we go. Oh, here comes the IL-10. Wow, it drops its bombs way, way off. Uh-oh. ROC force is getting reinforcements. All right, let's see who else we can bring up to support. We'll keep that MG in the back, that uh, mounted MG, just in case we have to flip it around on the enemy. Uh oh, one of our guys is down. Medic! Oh, and the grenade, too. Yeah, our guys are smart enough to take cover, except for one of them took cover right on top of the grenade. Let's get this in. There we go. Alright. Fling him back, boys. Let's uh, take control ourselves and start taking down some of these guys. There we go. Oh, another wounded. Alright, looks like some of those forces are backing off. Is this a medic? I wouldn't be surprised. Where's our medic now? Medic, we need you up here. Huh. We, did we lose him? Alright, let's continue pushing up then. Yeah, we, we may have lost our medic. I don't see his icon anywhere. Even though he's probably the first one I would have healed up, but that's okay. We've got plenty of reinforcements. We don't need a stinking medic. Alright, let's push up. We're going to get to the end of this trench and continue to clear the line. Looks like there are some enemy forces here, so we'll just, uh, grab one of the grenade, uh, one of the uh, MGs and look out for grenades. Yep, there they come. There we go. Clean out that position. Enemy forces running out of the trench. Friendly there. 
Hard to tell sometimes. The uniforms are kind of similar. All right, looks like one guy escaped back here. So what we got to do is clear this position out. So hopefully our friendlies push up. And there seems to be one guy who, a little rascal, got back here. Where'd he go? Where is he? He's hiding back here somewhere. Let's push through this mountain. Oh, or we can climb the mountain, I guess. Wow, look at that. May want to modify some of that so that way uh, players can't jump up over that. Oh, there he is. He's hiding right there. Let's throw a grenade down at him. Come on, guys. You should be able to shoot him. There we go. All right, good. All right. The epicness of climbing uh, that mountain is over. And there's one guy left. Let's clear him out. And that should be that. That will be our first objective to complete. To make sure we get reinforcements for a second wave. Oh, did he climb up over here? Is there somebody hiding around here now? Where are they at? They're around here somewhere. Most of our comrades made it to the trench, but they didn't bother to clear out some of these positions. Let's see, where are they? Ah, here they are. <laughs> I like how he walked right up to him. Okay, so we lost support from the IL-10 and the uh, cruiser as well, the frigate. That sucks. Jesus. These guys love to scream at like a basic order. All right, uh, we're going to move into marching formation for Chow. Okay. These guys really are screaming. I don't know why. Nobody's getting shot or anything. All right, let's capture that. Uh... Okay, okay, these guys are really dramatic. All right, let's go ahead and grab uh, that uh, gun there. We want this uh, M8 howitzer. That can definitely be useful against the enemy positions. Looks like this is the hill that's bringing their commands. Look at that. That is a big position. There are uh, multiple bunkers, barbed wire, probably meaning mines too, I would assume, are on the barbed wire. That's what I've seen before. Three bunkers. And the ROC flag that has to come down. And on the right side, it looks like a pretty good armored position. or Well, not armored position, but a entrenched position with uh, three bunkers as well. And a uh, M45 Maxim AA. Now, the thing about these smaller bunkers is that these can be destroyed with artillery. So that would be a useful thing. So let's bring our artillery gun over here. And uh, we'll go ahead and start firing at those positions. We're going to attack left first since we've got most of our men there. Oh, we do have a medic. What the hell? All right, anyway. We'll keep our medic back. Oh, look at this. All right, so friendly troops are here. So we're going to wait for the uh, AI to take the brunt of enemy fire. And then uh, we'll go ahead and move him right behind him because they're uh, basically newbies. We need uh, something to attract the fire of this bunker. And also it looks like there's a smaller bunker here too. And uh, obviously we can't see anybody in it at the moment. But obviously why would it be unoccupied? Holy crap. These Chinese guys are just screaming. They are like motivated, man. They are ready to kick ass. All right. They are passionate. Okay. So we're going to wait and... Hopefully our comrades move up over the hill. They're just like stupid. They're just running up over the top of a mountain. All right, let's go ahead and start opening fire then on the left side. There should be a bunker here. So we'll go ahead and uh, keep some of our guys in cover. Meanwhile, we'll move out with some of these sailors and uh, push up to the first bunker here. Hopefully we can clear that. Looks like our comrades are assaulting on the right side as well, so let's try to support them best we can. The M8 has uh, five rounds, so literally nothing. So we've got to be very accurate in trying to destroy some bunkers. Hopefully we can do that. Meanwhile, on the left side, it looks like we're engaging an enemy bunker already. A little uh, defensive position. We'll stay here and continue to open fire. So we'll take this will take precedence on the right side then. Let's go ahead and try to open fire on that first bunker and crack it open. Nope, way off. Yep, that accuracy, that's what'll kill you. All right, next shot, I'm going to try to get it. I, I want to pull the top of that bunker right off. Let's try it again. Nope. The other thing we could try to destroy is that Max and AA, but that's just not going to happen, I think. Let's try one more time. Almost reloaded. Here we go. No, nothing. It went into a tree. So as you can tell, the artillery is uh, quite frustrating, too. Sometimes. 
We'll try it this way. Maybe if we hit a target a little further, the shell will come down and we'll have a we'll score. There we go. All right, direct hit. No damage to the bunker and didn't kill anyone inside. Let's try for the max in AA then. I think this is our last shell. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we'll get lucky. Well, we killed that guy in front of it, but I don't think the gun was damaged in any way. But we are very accurate with that, so let's give it another shot. This should be the end of our artillery shells, I believe. There was five in reserve plus one in the uh, chamber. So. And that's it. All right, so no, no good on the artillery. If you're still watching, uh, no good artillery down in, uh, down in the comment section, guys. I'm loving this mod so far, though. Really cool to see some fights from the Chinese Civil War. And get no love from that artillery, man. That was, that was a shame. Best case scenario, we would have taken the top off one of the bunkers and hit that maxim, but that would have been about it with five shells. I mean, there's really not much you can do. Okay, we're going to move all the way to the left, and we're going to push up on that position now. There's uh, a few guys left around this bunker, so let's try to clear it out. We'll move our forces up. Yep. Man, quite a fight. Quite a fight. All right, we're going to move up, continue to push up. And you guys, by the way, if you want to watch us play live, don't forget to check us out at twitch.tv forward slash Rat Pack 2. We do play Men of War Assault Squad there quite often. So if you want to support us there, be sure to follow that link down in the description. All right, we're going to grenade this position out because they're just hiding behind some rocks. So let's get them out of here. Oh, yeah, we're going to take some losses here. There's an MG position and nowhere to hide. All right. Okay, we've cleared out this position. They've got some stairs here, a little road with a... Uh-oh, there's an MG up there. He's got a bar. Wow, and he, he's, he doesn't care who he's shooting at, does he? All right, let's go ahead and push up to that stairwell. That, that'll be our defensive area there. Try to attract fire from that bunker. Meanwhile, we'll move up with our real troop assault. This will be... Uh, this is the real thing here. Distracting with that defensive position, but moving up to the bottom of the stairs. Let's get some grenades up there. Come on, guys. Toss your grenades. Oh, right. Hey, we don't even need to use them. We killed off a lot of those guys. Beautiful. Ooh, a lot of our guys wounded here, too, by the way, by that MG. Damn MG. We do have a medic alive, according to our squad indicator. Who's the medic? Assault rifleman. Sailor. I don't know who's got the medic pack. He's still alive, though, because there was a medic indicator above the squad. This is where you'll end up dying, by the way, is uh, wasting time looking for your medic. There we go. All right, let's try to save some of these guys. Did you grab the medic bag? Come on, bro, you need that medic bag. All right, the medic's dead. That's all right. So long as we save a guy or two, we'll get out of here. Come on. There we go. All right, we're going to move up here now and get our medic with us during the attack. A couple of guys left back here attracting fire from that bunker. Looks like it may have been decrewed finally. The MG is down. All right, we're going to move up. Looks like our uh, friendly allies are trying to climb the mountain too. Yep, look at these uh, explosion. The uh, craters here caused by the explosions, all mines. So good thing we did not go up that way. Plus there's barbed wire, so I don't know how the hell you expect to climb that. Okay, boys, let's get up there. So if we go up the stairs, that's probably going to be death. They're probably waiting right there for us. What the hell was that? My god, they tried to shoot at us. Alright, let's crawl up here now. Be all careful. And then we'll rush right here and throw grenades from this other side. It's going to be brutal. Here it comes. Alright, throw grenades, throw grenades, throw grenades. Come up from this left side now. Oh shit, there's a whole support squad right there. What the hell? Bastards killed a couple of our guys. Let's get them. Cowards. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, he got screwed by his own grenade. Counter grenade. Secondary grenade that I threw kind of like pushed it into the right direction. That was kind of nice. All right, let's get the rest of our guys up here. We're not going to go directly into that trench. One of our guys actually did make it into there. I can't believe that. We're going to try to flank the trench and uh, kill off. Actually, we can uh, now that we've got the trench halfway, we can just hop into it and try to take it from that other position. So we'll try to move it up from here. Yeah, they got MGs in the thing. That's what I'm trying to avoid. Ah, screw it. Let's rush them. 
That's what we do best. Come on, Chinese forces, let's go. For the people. Kill those stragglers. All right, come on. Throw grenades into each one of those doors. Wonder if there's anybody in this uh, bunker. Looks like we cleared this one out. There we go. Okay, looks like the bunkers are primarily clear. There's still a few guys in them. Let's go in there and see if anybody's alive. Oh, there's one guy right there. Wonder if we can fire in that position from here. I doubt it. There's one straggler. There he goes. The enemy's HQ is captured by us and their commander is eliminated. Uh oh, some of our guys are still walking into mines. Okay, well, we're going to come down the way we came. So let's go ahead and get out of here with the, all of our forces. We'll group up, and now we have to attack that next position. That's some AI walking around that you hear uh, walking onto the mines. All right, good. All of our forces are making their way down the hill. Back the way they came. Okay, so we've got a uh, captured MG here, too. We'll move that guy off. We're going to link everybody up down here, heal up, and then start the final assault here where some straggler forces are not making any progress whatsoever. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, get some of our forces ready to rock. We'll come come down this way, down this road here, and then we'll uh, take some cover around this mountain area and uh, basically rush the uh, Maxim MG, which apparently is shooting at other friendly so uh, if it's got there if it's got its attention that's fine then we'll move through okay we got a whole squad here squad one ready squad two ready and then finally hopefully nobody walks on any mines for the love of god and then finally uh, a couple of uh, stragglers here boy I'm using that word a lot aren't I straggler 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 but what is good is that at least those individual soldiers will be remembered forever, especially as Soldier 1419. I think Chairman Mao actually tried to experiment with uh, giving, taking people's names away and giving them just numbers. Yeah, I know. But in his ultimate wisdom, we've decided to take this island, and now we're going to make the final push directly into enemy forces. You know, that's the glorious way to do it. So what I plan to do is to, to, to basically distract that gun. I'm going to try to run up behind the gun and uh, have it fire at me from here. Meanwhile, other forces will be firing from here as well. <laughs> I know those guys, every time they get shot at, they just shriek with absolute fear. Uh, they're really, truly uh, like farmers and such. You can just tell. Okay, let's go ahead and get ready to move into that position. We'll go ahead and move up to the top of the mountain. So hopefully having this gun have to turn between multiple targets will be useful. It's already distracted here by some forces, so I'm going to attack it from here and there. So first what I'm going to do is rush into this position. Get ready. Three, two, one, go. All right, now that we've got its attention. What the hell? No, oh my god, we got to run all the way over there? Oh, it could have been a slaughter. That gun was definitely going to shoot at us. He must have been reloading or something, but uh, we'll all go ahead and edit that out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everything went totally according to plan, you guys, as it does first time all the time here at uh, at uh, the channel. Thank you for your tuning in and showing your support. All right, we're going to grenade the hell out of that thing. Let's have one guy sneak up there. And by sneak, I mean run out in the open in plain sight. Oh, he doesn't have an MG. Damn it. He doesn't have a grenade is what I meant. Let's get that thing's attention. We're taking losses that we don't need to. Kill that bastard. Get him off that gun. All right, let's get on it ourselves. Ah, uh, wasn't meant to be. That's right. We've got the position now. Uh, we've got a medic somewhere, but we don't have time for this. Let's take this position, boys. Grenade the hell out of those trenches. Let's get out of here. Let's get this war over with. There we go, they cleared up most of that position. Let's get a rifleman on that gun. Hell, dude. Can we not take this gun again? Ah, apparently not. Doesn't matter. We'll clear out the rest of this trench by hand. We don't need any of that capitalist technology. We'll do it the Chinese way. Alright, let's clear it out. All the way up. And this should be done. One one last 
soldier. That's it. The enemy's ground base is cleared. Okay. And with that, the flag will no longer fly. Wonderful. A very cool mission, a very cool mod. Some small things that could definitely be adjusted to make it a better experience, but really, I liked it a lot. So thanks to the mod makers. When you go there, tell them Raptor sent you. Show them some love. Download it, share it with a friend, and do so with this video as well. Tell someone uh, that you enjoyed it and help us to grow, as you guys always do. So thanks so much. We're going to have a cringe briefing now from, uh, I think, voice acting in Meta War is traditionally bad from everyone, even, when, even the game itself. So let's go ahead and listen to the debriefing. January 18th, 1955. The People's Liberation Army launched the Battle of Yijiangshan Island. By January 20th, 1955, all resistance were ended and the island was formally declared to be firmly in people's hands. 567 people of the Republic of China Armed Forces, including the Defense Troop Commander, were killed, and 519 were taken as POWs. 393 comrades of the People's Liberation Army sacrificed their lives, and 1,024 were wounded. Half a month later, Operation King Kong was oh, launched. Sweet. All ROC troops and civilians retreated from Dachan Island. By February 13, 1955, all offshore islands of Zhejiang Province were liberated. Mission accomplished. Wonderful. I like that a lot. I really would like to see some more from the uh, Chinese Civil War. It's a very interesting period of time that not a lot of people really uh, know too much about. It's not something that's kind of openly known, us, except for just kind of a few things. Um, so anyway, that's it for now. I will see you guys next time. Thanks for your support. A very cool mod. And I guess actually that was that was not too bad. Vo when you're doing narration, I guess that's a little better than when you're trying to pretend like you're under fire when you're like in your apartment or something like that, like just screaming into the mic. But anyway, that's it. Until next time, password, pimp hand strong. Thanks for joining me, guys.